unit for the North, Jason Hooley. This song is dedicated to Terry. Well done, guys. Great start to the show. Well done. You love it over there. Okay, Dahi, I'm going to come to you first. We've had traditional groups in all shapes and sizes. This is the biggest one we've had yet on the stage here tonight. Did they gel? Yeah, totally. And I kind of really like the way you rocked it up as well. It's a fantastic song, but you made it your own. I think sometimes bands can fall into doing what other bands did. Uh, you did it your own way. Great song. You have a great front man, but there's also a very, uh, you have a secret hidden talent, and that's the banjo man behind there. Yeah. John, six working lads. The yeah. dream is to be able to leave what the day job is and, and do it for a living. Could, could they? Yeah, well, the way I see it is there were six modes on stage, but there was only one voice. And I thought that with so many people in the band that we would have had some harmonies, I thought I'd missed that. Um, also, the songs about the carefree life of a raggle taggle gypsy. Oh, I found very little performance, apart from Porrick, uh, the vocalist, I found otherwise that, uh, that you weren't raising the game. The only thing is Tyrone have a habit of winning all Ireland's and they come out and vote. So we'll see, we'll see. Okay, Blonna, you have race session, of course, already mm -hmm. through. How do the lads compare here? Mm -hmm. Oh, I enjoyed it. It reminded me of kind of the Water Boys and, and Mike Scott a bit there. I do think Porrick is carrying the others, though. Uh, not to take from what you guys are doing, but you seem to be up there on your own a lot, Porrick. But I really enjoyed it, and as I said, I, I love the kind of Water Boys feel to it. Okay, Shane, you've been very vocal in the recent past in saying this is not a singing show, it's a talent show. Do you think the guys entertained us in the way that you've been talking about? Without a doubt. No, it was actually brilliant. I, I, I I really enjoyed it, both play, lads, both play. Good job, 100%. Okay, Dana, you're, are you proud of the lads? Of course oh, you are. I would not have changed one thing. I think your musicianship is fantastic. Every one of you was into the music and you were just engaging all of us. I wouldn't have changed one thing. Congratulations. Now, it was said by the other judges, John in particular, and Blonage did second it, that Pork seemed to be up there on his own. There were harmonies and a bit more singing, missing. Well, uh, you know, it's nice to have harmonies in there. It's not always necessary to have harmonies in there. As you can see, when the Dubliners would sing, someone would take the front and they would sing. Mm. They wouldn't always have harmonies in it. You don't always need harmonies. I thought you were fantastic. Okay. <laughs> Judges, your scores for Chase and Hooley, please. John Creedon. Uh, I'd love to do more for the North. I would if I could, but I've got to call it as I see it. It's a six for me. Blonde Nichoffi. 
I really enjoyed it, but I felt Porik was up there on his own. It's a seven from me. Shane Lynch. A very enjoyable eight, lads. Well done. Dahi O'Shea. I love the way you rocked it up. I thought she played very well. And it's nine from me. So that's a total of 30 out of 40 for Jason.